With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello. So the question here is two point charges separated by a distance d repel each other with a force of 9 newton. The separation between them becomes 3d. The force of repulsion will be 1 newton, 3 newton, 6 newton or 27 newton. So we have two charges, two point charges which are separated by a distance d. Okay. The distance between them is d. Now let us say this charge is q1 and this charge is q2. So according to Coulomb's law, the force between them would be f is equal to 1 upon 4 pi epsilon 0 q1 q2 upon d square. Let us say this is our equation number 1. Now it is said that the distance between the charges is 3d. So the new distance is 3d. The charges are still the same q1 and q2. So new force f dash would be 1 upon 4 pi epsilon 0. The charges are same q1 into q2 upon 3d whole square. Now this becomes f dash is equal to 1 upon 4 pi epsilon 0 q1 q2 upon 9 into d square. Let us say this is equation number 2. Now dividing both 1 and 2 we get dividing 2 by 1 we get f dash upon f is equal to now this 1 upon 4 pi epsilon 0 term will get cancelled out and q1 q2 will also get cancelled out. So we are left with 9 d square and d square. So d square d square will also get cancelled out. Now f dash is equal to f divided by 9. This is our initial force. Now it is given in the question that the initial force is 9 newtons. So substituting the value we get f dash our new force is equal to 9 upon 9 which comes out to be 1 newton. So our new force f dash would be 1 newton. This is our answer. Now let us check the options. So our option first is the correct answer. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.